Elon Musk asks one question to spot a genius while recruiting top talent for his high-tech companies. It is a question that helps the Tesla and SpaceX CEO to identify the most intelligent persons during the interview. It is interesting that science has proven that question to be effective. Join me today in this video as we explore in detail the question that Musk uses to spot a genius in his interviews. Elon's interview question is so challenging that most people do not even attempt it. This works pretty cool for the tech-savvy CEO who is determined to recruit the best of the best engineers and other tech experts into his companies. His question is more of a brain teaser which has more than one answer. Musk's favorite interview question reads, You're standing on the surface of Earth. You walk one mile south, one mile west, and one mile north. You end up exactly where you started. Where are you? That is it. The question is not that tricky as most people would think. But just solving this question, you can land a job at Tesla, SpaceX, Neuralink, or Elon's companies. The question is head-spinning and is meant to reveal a candidate's potential when they are under pressure. Let alone the question, most interviewees panic when being interviewed by persons in the caliber of Elon. If you are scratching your head at Elon's brain teaser, you're not alone. Even most engineers who have made it to Musk's interview usually guess the answer. You can also make your guess too. But do not let the question worry you. Here is the hint to the question. Like most brain teasers and riddles, the tech icon's question has more than one answer. Most people who answered the question correctly gave the North Pole as the answer. Here is why. If you move in the directions given by the SpaceX CEO, you will end up making a triangle. Due to the Earth's curvature, you will just end up where you started, which is the North Pole. Once an applicant has given North Pole as an answer, Musk will also ask the where else could it be? It is only the most intelligent people who are able to figure out the second solution to the question. Very few people will give the second correct answer as South Pole, which is even more complicated. Let us just leave the explanation to the geniuses. I just don't want to bore you with a lot of geophysics. Just like other brain teasers, the answer is not that important. Whether your answer is North Pole, South Pole, or any other, it doesn't matter. The answer is just irrelevant. The question is meant to gauge critical thinking skills of the candidate. It is more of how one arrives at the answer than getting the right answer. To some extent, almost any answer is acceptable so long as one is able to back it up. The question helps Musk to have a look at the thinking process of prospective employees. It also helps assess whether the candidate is able to work under pressure. Employees in Elon Musk's companies must be prepared to face a lot of pressure as they have to deliver projects in tight and hard deadlines. Even the CEO himself gets to experience the pressure which makes him work for more than 100 hours a week. When the pressure is too much, the Tesla founder does not go home but sleeps on the Tesla floor. Moreover, he also works night shifts and during the weekends. At Tesla, SpaceX and Neuralink there is just too much to do. It is only employees who have a strong support system that will withstand the high pressure. You are probably wondering why the Tesla founder and CEO asks that question. You will actually be more interested on the question given that he asks it to all the applicants. There is some magic behind the question. It is pretty cool to unmask Musk's secrets behind his favorite interview question. First, Musk asks the question because it relates to physics. It is talking about the Earth and its poles. The tech icon has a great passion for physics. He even graduated with a bachelor's in physics from the University of Pennsylvania. He performed so well in physics that he won a scholarship to go and take a PhD in physics at Stanford University. But as fate would have it, he dropped out two days later after registering for his doctorate so that he could focus on building his internet company. It is just expected that his common interview question would have a touch of physics. He also asks the question to help spot a genius since he is also a genius himself. It is estimated that Elon has an IQ of 155 like other geniuses. As a genius, Musk would want to attract people of his caliber to his companies. In physics, unlike poles attract, but in business, it is the like minds that attract. So, if you are not highly intelligent, Musk's question will repel you away. The tech-oriented CEO is interested in working with extremely bright people since his companies handle sophisticated technology. Musk's employees have to be extremely intelligent as they will have to solve some of the hardest problems. During recruitment, the tech CEO is interested in persons that have exceptional ability. He cares less about a college degree. It is true that graduating from college is not that important since some of the greatest tech icons in the world are college dropouts. 
Apple's Steve Jobs, Microsoft's Bill Gates, and Facebook's Mark Zuckerberg top the list of highly intelligent college dropouts, and the list is endless. But I won't forget the great Nikola Tesla, who studied engineering and physics in the 1870s without receiving a degree. One nice thing about Musk's interview question is that it gives chances to the Nikola Teslas of today. It won't be a big surprise if some of the best engineers in Tesla have no college degree. Elon Musk's recruitment drive at Giga Berlin gives us a hint of how the tech genius recruits top talent for his companies. The tech icon made a tweet saying, Recruiting ace engineers for Giga Berlin. We'll interview in person tomorrow on site. Send resume to 25guns at tesla.com. From the tweet, the Tesla CEO does not just want engineers, but ace engineers. It simply means those who are exemplary, or in other words, genius engineers. Elon will not just believe all engineers simply because they say they are exceptional. He uses his common interview question to help him identify the most intelligent applicants. The tech icon will conduct the interview in person. Musk does not leave anything to chance when recruiting new people to his team. He literally interviews all of them. It is hard and tiresome, but the hardworking boss will always make time for the interviews. So it is Musk who gets to ask his famous question. Anyway, it is his question. It just makes sense when he is the one asking the question. His managers may not understand the question as the tech geniuses would do. Musk has requested them to send their resumes to a given email. This gives the tech billionaire an opportunity to gauge the communication skills of the applicants. It is often a great opportunity for introverts and deep thinkers since they do not perform very well in oral interviews. Employees working for Musk's companies must be able to communicate effectively. As a recruiter, you will gain a lot from Musk and Tesla's recruitment strategy. It is not just enough to ask questions, but you need to ask the right questions. For Elon, he has identified that one question that will help him spot geniuses. It won't be of great help if you copied Musk's question, but rather copy his strategy. His question may not work for you as your company could be totally different from his. As such, it makes more sense if you can also create that one question that can help your organization to recruit the best of the best. The question should be one that helps you peer into the thinking process of the interviewees. Moreover, the question should put the applicants under pressure just like Musk's questions. Above all, it needs to help you bring on board the smartest people. Having learned of Musk's question in the interviews, you now have what it takes to nail any interview that comes your way. You just have to be confident and clear in your thinking process when handling brain teasers similar to that of Musk's. With that, you will win the confidence of your potential employers. So, if you ever apply for a role at SpaceX or Tesla, keep this question in mind. Give Elon Musk the correct answer and he will identify you as a genius. Sooner or later, the job will be yours. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe with all notifications enabled so that you don't miss out on the latest Elon Musk news. Anyways guys, if you want to see more interesting videos, click the video right above.